like we're gonna be helping our last person here in the spirit and the mouse. If you remember, it's gonna be the guy that's trying to heat up his quiche with a hairdryer. <laughs> so he desperately needs our help. So let's just dive in. Before we go help the guy, I think there was a kibling that we could go talk to that was helping us with, I think we were trying to help him collect all the light bulbs. And I think I haven't talked to him in a while. So let's go check on him real quick. We have more light bulbs for you. I'm so sorry. <laughs> it's taken so long to come back to you. We've been a little busy with power lines and looks like you're a little drunk or being electrocuted. <laughs> looks like you found some light bulbs. Let's put them back where they belong. I was like, did we only do like two? <laughs> okay. Beautiful, thanks a lot, little mouse. Now, how can I return the favor? Oh, we can get stuff for you. East Street map. Eastern part of St. Clair will have no more secrets for you. We're not even in East... Um, we're not even in East Street, so there's no point to that. Boda mode. Oh, so we could buy fast travel. Is it even worth it? <laughs> just to say we have it, we can just fast travel. Why not? Come again, mouse, so you know where to find me. Well, let's fast travel, because might as well use it. If we can find where we're going. <laughs> okay, pizzeria. Eugene. Juliet, it's this guy, Paul, how do we fast travel, can we only go Lumion, mysterious hole, change room, huh, so sir, do you want to tell us how we use our infamous fast travel, because you kind of sold us on it, but did not teach us how to use it. Well, <laughs> we tried. We can just go the long way. It's fine. It's fine. It's not like we wasted 50 energy to get something we can't use. So it's fine. Okay, so let's, let's just try one more time. I feel like there has to be a way to... To use it. Hmm... There's a mysterious hole, though. I don't recall ever seeing that. I kind of want to go see that, so let's go check that out real quick. Maybe that's how we're supposed to do it. Because I don't recall that ever being the case. So let's find out what this is. This mysterious hole of some sort. It's behind you. Up here. Oh, there's some energy. There's something here. It has to be over here somewhere, right? Okay. Is it this? thing. Oh, we have a little cheese! <laughs> Is that it? <gasps> oh, so cute! Okay, I'm keeping that. Oh, that was worth it. Now we're a real Parisian with a little, a little hat, <laughs> a little beret. Can you actually teach us how to use the fast travel? <laughs> Hello, mouse. You know I can teach you how to teleport back here. Why didn't you teach me when you taught me that? You just have to find some light bulbs for me. Okay, open your map and teleport to me in South Square from everywhere. Extremely helpful. <laughs> well then, that's what I get for not reading what we bought, but I love his hat. <laughs> Worth it, I guess. 
So let's go back. Ah, if only I knew we could wear little hats. I feel like a missed opportunity. <laughs> okay, so let's head over. And let's see if we can climb on anything. Alright, so here he is. So what we're gonna do is, first things first, find the Kipling box. <laughs> I love that you can hear the hair dryer. So can we go anywhere else? We're coming back. <laughs> this, I'm assuming, is not... Yep, yeah, it's locked. What else can we climb on? Oh, here. Um, okay, great. So let's climb up. I absolutely love his hat. <laughs> it gives him a je ne sais quoi. <laughs> so let's see. Kibbling box, oh kibbling box. Wherefore art thou? Here. After closer inspection, there's a label, North Residential. Do you want to turn it on? Yes. Malfunction, 30 energy required to boot. Fee boom. We got you. You have plenty to spare. Yum. Oh, you're missing an eye. Oh. 50, 90. It's more like a wink. Hello, world. North residential Kibling box not functional at the moment. Cannot be powered. Kiblings are currently missing. Are part of Kibling box necessary power reboot? Can you find and bring them back? Yes. That is our duty. Thank you, Rodan. Activating KTS. How can you not know from our little hat we mean business? <laughs> oh, initializing KTS. So there's two Kiblings we're looking for. Disabling Kiblings camouflage. Okay, a little hard hat. Oh, so cute. The assistance, okay. I think the one that had the... Oh, there, uh, oh, never mind. I thought I saw him. <laughs> Same thing with the little hard hat was like on a bridge, right? Was that the bridge? Let's see if we can find him. So let's head back down. Let's check the little um, bridge over here. Oh, here you are. Hi. What can we help you with? Kickling. Hi there, little mouse. What is your business here? My business is to help you with your business. Oh, you're helping Kiblings? Then it's my lucky day. The Kibling box we were attending to was in really bad shape and lightning strike from earlier didn't help. Parts of it blew out in this neighborhood. Before I could pick them up, some humans threw them in the trash cans. Without those components, a Kibling box cannot power the surrounding buildings properly. And all the humans inside are deprived of electricity. Well, technically just one person. <laughs> you cannot let those humans down. I agree. This is where you and I come in. <laughs> Professional gatherer can help all those parts, but I'll need your help as I forge through the trash cans in the neighborhood. <laughs> parts are pretty heavy. Do you think you could help me gather them? Yes. But maybe later. I just won't ever come back. <laughs> awesome, let's go. We have four parts to find. Let's look around the neighborhood for trash cans. I sense one nearby. Oh. Trash. Looking for trash. You're just gonna follow me. <laughs> so cute. It's good up though. It's pretty good. Let's see, where's a trash can? I feel like I've seen one recently. Oh, I like this one. The one that's like glowing. <laughs> so does he find it? Oh, I thought you guys can, can grow. The parts we're looking for should be inside. Let's dive in. Uh, I'm okay. I'm gonna stay out here. Oh, there's a lot in there. Oh, found it. Can you clean the mess while I get the killing box part out? Just shock him this way. You're gonna put me to work. Clean up trash. <laughs> so cute. Phew. Um, sir? I only have three parts left. Let's find them. You could literally land anywhere else. Anywhere. Um, will they be downstairs as well? 
Oh, you can just hover. Let's see. Trash. Oh, try her. Two of four. I really do like that everyone has their own little, um, little task. It stinks. Someone's got to do it, I guess. Here I go. It's all you. As we support out here for remaining trash. <laughs> oh, I found it. Sure. We'll clean up. Clean. Oh, there's a lot of trash out here. I don't understand why he's throwing everything out to find one thing. I just let him move it to the side. Phew. We need two more parts. Okay, that's two or four. Let's try over here. We have recycling. There we go. We know the drill. I never understood humans. They throw a lot of good stuff away. Anyway, time to dive in. I guess that's fair. I think that's as fair. Jeez, and you're really polluting everything. Are you just doing this for me to do something? Like, it's like he's just walking around. He might as well do something while we're something of substantial importance. Phew. We're only missing one part. Um, I don't think there's any more this way. Oh, I stand corrected. I should say. So here we are. Four of four. I'm sure the last part we're looking for is in there. Here I go. All you. And we'll we'll clean up. No need to ask us again. I got it. <laughs> I know the ritual right now. We're good. I shock. You come back out. You got it. We're all good. <laughs> we finished gathering all the killing box parts, little mouse. Thanks for assisting me with this task. Thanks to our combined efforts, the humans will soon have their electricity back. Ah, it feels amazing to perform such a good deed. I even feel even stronger. Too bad the humans don't know we exist. What if we, like, walked by? Like, can you imagine just watching, seeing a kibling and a mouse right outside your window just chatting? <laughs> uh, anyway, it was nice meeting you, little mouse. I'll go back to the kibling box now. Hi! See you. And speaking of which, so the machine helps us... Oh, I have two eyes now. Helps us see the, the kiblings, but does it work for everyone? Can everyone see the kiblings? Or is it just us? So we have one more kibling left. Now, where was he? I know he was like a little, like, um, underwater submerged outfit. So maybe by the water? Is that him over there? I think that's him. Okay, we just gotta get over. So I think we have to go... If we go up, getting our workout in. <laughs> I think if we go up, there should be a portal that we can go down, I think. So let's go do that. Just around the corner here. I would absolutely love to live in this town. I feel like I already know it. <laughs> I think if we drop. Oh, light bulb. And then one more. Can we not traverse? Okay. For some reason, we can't. There we go. We're here. Oh. This is a little scary. <laughs> you there. Yes, you come closer. You're the spirit guardian mouse I've heard so much about. Kai Dive! <laughs> Let me introduce myself. I am Kai Dive, the great inventor. I created a diving suit made especially for kiblings that allow us to swim underwater without risking electrocution. Are we gonna use one? Now you might be thinking, but Kai Dive, why? To which I reply, why not? <laughs> Technology does not require a specific need to be made. I really don't like when his eyes go like super small. This is how we will achieve greatness. And oh, sorry, I'm rambling again. Truth be told, little mouse, I was gonna ask for your help about something. You must have sensed that our killing box out of service right now. Saying too much damage during the thunderstorm. 
Some parts of Healing Box land in the water over there. Oh, interesting. So I thought, great, now's the time to put my Mark III diving suit suit, suit, suit to the test. So the one time something really important Aww. happens, you want to put your thing to the test. Shouldn't we have had some trials before? <laughs> Unfortunately, those metal parts are very hard to grab by hand. I need to build a special tool to hook them. Like, like a fishing rod? Like a fishing rod or something? But I need an assistant. My colleague is usually here to help me, but they went to the bridge to find the other missing parts. And then they also abandoned you because they went to the killing box. <laughs> Little Mouse, would you make me the honor of being my assistant for a moment? Of course. Of course. Of course! No one would pass up such an amazing opportunity. I agree. When's the next time I'm gonna find a killing that's who's gonna need me to go into water for them? <laughs> I'm gonna tell you which pieces I need. Please shock them to send them back to me. Ready? I'm counting on you, little mouse. Oh, you're hard at work. Let's begin. Let's start with cogs. Bring me two. Are these cogs? Did you get it? Good. Now I need some copper wire. Bring me one. No more, no less. So picky. There you go. One. Now bolts. I need two, quick. Bolts, bolts, bolts. <laughs> one, two. Very nice. For our first prototype, it seems sturdy. I'll call it the Oripoon. <laughs> I feel like it should also have our name part of it. Time to put this monster to the test. Let's jump in. But I can also get electrocuted. <laughs> can I get a little suit? Are we just waiting out here for you? Yep. Nice. Phew, it worked. Check this catch. Let me put it away. Ah. Oh, what happened? Dang it, the prototype broke. And I saw two other pieces down there. We've got to make a stronger harpoon. <laughs> Round two. I've got an idea. Get ready to send me the materials. Springs, springs, springs. One. It would be nice if this was, like, timed. Metal bars. Four. Two, three, four. Now bolts. I just want to see if I go slow. Does it matter how long it takes me? I don't think it does. One. Two. I guess it's just cozy. We don't need to rush anybody. <laughs> Two. Three. Four. Beautiful. It seems much more robust than the first one. I'll call it Super Orpoon. <laughs> Do you think your will have to fix it again for the a third time? Phew, that one was really stuck in the mud and hard to grab. You have no idea what kind of stuff lies below. <laughs> it's pretty scary. Oh, <laughs> called it. <laughs> and of course, the prototype broke. <laughs> now it's time to make the strongest orpoon ever made on this planet. Ugh. That really, let's make it real sturdy. The last piece is really stuck. <laughs> Crafting time. You have to just believe us. We can do it, Cogs. Here. One, two, three, four. We can literally make the best prototype ever. Metal bars. One. It seems like he's also kind of just making this up as he goes. He's like, you know what, just bring me four. It's gonna obviously be strong in the last one. <laughs> Cog says two here. All done? Metal bars, we, we did that already. One, two, three. Oh my, this is a masterpiece. Final Orpoon prototype. Orpoon X trademark pending. <laughs> oh, it looks fancy. Truly my best work. Let's put it to the test right now. Here I go. Honestly, that's that's pretty sturdy. Let me tell you. <laughs> Anytime now? Okay. That's it. We have all the killing box parts back. Nice work, Mouse. That was some fine resource handling on your side. I appreciate the help. You helped me refine the Orpoon X and elevated the rank of technological masterpiece. His eyes, though. I have to leave now, but I'll credit you when I show my creation to the Kipling Scientist Gathering next week. Perfect. That's all I ask. I just need a little bit of appreciation. See you around, Spirit Guardian. If you ever need help building something, I'd be glad to assist. Aw. He's the first one called Spirit Guardian. Bye-bye. This one's pretty easy as well. Reactivate Paul's apartment. Absolutely. I think this one's pretty easy. Um, the last one we did also with the, was it the ghost one we did? That one also was pretty easy. The one the pizzeria took a little while. I think they all had different like um, complexity levels. So let's go around. I think it's like the first one. 
with this crap. Let's reactivate Paul's apartment, and then hopefully Paul can actually use a microwave. <laughs> Status update, power up possible. Waiting for authorization. Proceed. Now that we have everyone, do you think Lumen's gonna give us something? Like make us like an honorary spare guardian? Cause we've literally done his job all night. And I think he should have power now once we're done here. Voila. Oh, all those house uh, apartments were out. Wait a minute, if how is he using the hair dryer then? If he doesn't have electricity, is it like battery powered? North Residential is now working correctly. I was programmed by the maker to reward kind souls. Please accept this gift. Thank you, thank you. You can call us anytime. Now entering idle mode. Goodbye. World. Thank you for helping us. We have to provide electricity to this part of town now. See you soon, mouse. Well, hopefully we don't see each other too soon, because that means you're not doing your job. <laughs> so let's go talk to Paul. Hmm. Oh, the power is back. I'm saved. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, little hair dryer, but you are no use. And the oven you go, little quiche. Quiche, oh, little quiche. Cook, cook, my little quiche. <laughs> quiche, quiche, quiche. <laughs> oh, so cute. Can't wait to gobble you up. He literally threw that hair dryer faster than you could say anything. But honestly, it's also been a couple episodes since we last talked to him, so you'd think the hair dryer would have done something by now. <laughs> quiche, quiche, quiche. Enjoy your little quiche. Let's <laughs> collect your happiness. Oh, his little hat! I love it! <laughs> Only I knew you could do hats before. So cute. Lumian, where are you? The quiche and the hair dryer. Mouse. That was the last one. Come back South Square and give me the happiness. With that, I should be able to go home at last. Still have enough power to teleport you back to me if you like. Uh, yes. Yeah, make us walk back. Hold on to your whiskers. Yeah, we're not walking on the back. Too. Oh! A little dramatic. <laughs> Ooh! Coming in hot. Well, 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 I felt the burst of positive energy even from way over here. You helped everyone, didn't you? Yes, that's what we literally did all night. We did not rest one bit. <laughs> yes, this is it. This happiness must be enough. There's nobody else in this village who needs anything. Alright, Mouse, fork it over. It's all yours. Oh. Enjoy it. Go home, Lumion. Looks like he's much stronger than before. Ah, uh, yes, this is it. I feel so much better. Finally, I'm my old self again. And finally, this awful place. Jeez, he literally did nothing. And this is a perfect town. Uh, someone else. You're talking nonsense, man. No time for your games. My mission here is done. Spirit Guardian Lumion, going back home. Well, later. Is there someone else we can help? What are we sensing? Oh! <laughs> Why did you do that? We're holding on! Stop, stop, stop! Someone still needs help? What are you speaking about? Eat that tickle! Let go of me! Let's talk this through like civil beasts! Huff, huff, will these humiliations never cease? Jeez, that's extreme! not sensing anything, and I know you can't. You're being ridiculous. We probably gained powers throughout the night. This has been a painfully long night, and it's time for it to end. Absolutely, positively, nobody who. who. Wait. You're right. But what I sense is different. It's not something we can fix. Who else needs help besides that little kidling down there with the lights? It's fine, but I can sense it. A lonely soul in need of help. 
That part of town's outside of our authority now. So there's no killing assigned to that area. Maybe that's where I'm supposed to go. Time will solve this problem. There's nothing for us to do. But we can. We still want to help them. But to get there, I'd have to give you some of my energy again. No, no, I'm done. No more. You can't help everyone, Mouse. Just accept it. Ugh, I can't. It's not in my nature. I need to, I need to help everyone. Ugh, fine. Very well. You win. I'll never understand you. You know, these people don't even know you exist, right? We're a mouse. Of course they do. What do you get out of it? Happiness? Kindness? You know, people are enjoying their lives? Ugh, never mind. I'll, I'll help you. Just don't forget to come back. If you don't replenish this power, I can't go home. <laughs> Gonna regret this. <laughs> Where is it, though? I don't think there's anyone else in the places we went. It, oh, is it that? Oh, Place de la Fontaine. Interesting, who's there? <laughs> and that's far more of my power than I anticipated. <sighs> you better make this work, Mouse. <laughs> now go check on what's happening in our isolated West residence. Come back with some happiness. <laughs> Try to be quick and have to leave before the sun rises or else. Won't say it won't be a pleasant experience. Hmm, what would happen though? Because you're also a ball of electricity. You're bright, the sun's bright. What could possibly happen? <laughs> and it's still dark. I think you're cool. <laughs> no need to fret about the light. Who is over here, honestly? And how did we sense it? It's up here. I guess nothing's here. Just, just a cute, super cute area. <laughs> West residents. If there's no kiblings, then what can we do? Oh, this is so cute. Hi. Why are you so alone? <laughs> Mouse. This place is very isolated from the rest of Saint A. Clair. Looks like you were right. I sent the sides villagers somewhere nearby. <laughs> However, I don't see the singles kept on around you. This is an off-grid house. Killing box here has been out of service for years. So you're all your own. <laughs> well, go to the human and let's hope you can find a way to help. Hmm. So I think we're actually going to stop it here for today. And then find out who this mysterious person is. So... Thank you guys so much for joining me. Go ahead and smash the subscribe button in this area here, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!